We are back with another episode of our Guild Wars 1 playthrough. We are at the Hinge of uh, Din Ravi. Hinge of Din Ravi? Ravi? I always call the Hinge of Din Ravi. Um, and that's what I'm going to call it. Uh, we are... This is kind of like the capital city of the Maguma jungle, I guess. We are safe from the White Mantle for now, but we are going to go to the next mission area. I can't remember. I think it's called like Rivers, Riverside Province, I think is next. Um, and we have a few quests to pick up to get us there. This is our friend Shadow. What does she want? Contain this message. Take it to Derek Deathblade. That's such a cool name. Derek Deathblade. Uh, <laughs> Riverside Province. Yeah, so this is going to take us to the next area. Um, show the seal to old Joan Jonas, the river guide in Tangle Roots. All right, and then I think there's another quest here. Let's see what Kira gives us. How can I help? Um, nothing. All right, great, good to Welcome, know. Friend. Um, why did she have an exclamation mark? We had like an exclamation mark for quest, but nothing happened. Evania has ordered a raid. If you're strong enough to help us, you should go to the river docks in the southeast corner of Tanglegroot and talk to the ferry captain. That's what I already planned to do. She's got some skills she can teach us. I don't think there's anything new here. Domination. Game. Pretty good one. We've been using Illusion lately. What does Arcane Conundrum do? Spells cast by target phone. All adjacent foes take twice as long. <clears throat> That's pretty nice. And when it ends, I get some energy. Clumsiness. Target and adjacent foes are hexed with clumsiness. The next time each foe attacks, the attack is interrupted and that foe suffers 59. Is this, a, this is an AoE hex that does it. It's an AoE hex interrupt and damager. That's a really nice skill. Interesting. Drain enchantments, not bad. Gives us some health and energy for stealing or for taking off an enchantment. Hmm. Let's look at some water magic hexes too. There's that maelstrom spell that I kind of liked, but 25 energy, I don't think we're going to be using that. Yeah, it's AoE damage and it interrupts spell casting every time it hits. Pretty powerful. Probably the one of the most powerful AoEs for water, I'm guessing. That and Deep Freeze. Deep Freeze is pretty nice. Blurred Vision. I wish Guild Wars that's one thing they did with Guild Wars 2 is they made um they made like cold or frozen or something a condition. I kind of wish they had done that for uh, Guild Wars 1. I feel like being cold should be a condition. Eh, I don't think we're going to get anything. I am tempted to get clumsiness. It does fit our illusion. Guilt or our illusion. Uh, what do you call it? Skill bar. I could replace blinding flash or... Immolate. I would probably I would probably replace immolate with it actually. I do like the Hmm. It might be more useful. Let's try it. I feel like we will use it eventually anyway. Yeah. I think it might be better than a We're gonna lose we're losing a condition. But I think we're actually gonna increase our damage and utility with that interrupt. And I like, I like the AoE hex element of it. All right. Wasting time. Let's get out of here. We're going to Tangle Root. Uh, where's the exit here? This place is huge. Hinge of Denravi is massive. Um, yes, here's the way. We decided we're not going to get any new armor. I don't want to spend any money whenever we're getting closer to max level armor anyway. If for some reason we find out we're way too squishy, we might. Um, 
upgrade our armor, but probably not. Probably not gonna need it. Uh, so I need to follow... Carlotta? Yeah, follow Carlotta. You gonna move this slowly the whole time? Oh my gosh. Pick it up. First person mode. I'm, I'm guessing we're going to be getting ambushed. Nice. Put clumsiness on this dude. interesting that it's a necromancer but it has no skill no spells that i can steal hmm. yeah clumsiness is pretty good damage oh i don't know why i use that all right where'd carlotta go Oh, there she is. She shows up on my mini-map. That's good. This is giving me flashback to the... What was Aiden's wolf name? Or not Aiden's wolf. There was that ranger NPC. He led us through the uh, ice caves. They're just kind of recycling that sort of quest. Let's steal a monk spell. Horizon of healing. I was kind of hoping we could get this Holy Wrath spell. That would be a good one to have. Oh, I thought... Oh, never mind. Max armor for shield is 16, not 12. Like, was that... Would it be? Okay, Carlotta! I guess that's why she was... I thought she was moving slow, but she's not. I like the clumsiness. This is a good spell to get, especially against those stupid jades or those, uh, what are they called? Moss scarabs. Guy out. Check out this guy. Yeah, Carl Carlotta's just trucking on, trucking ahead. Okay. Man, the the monk, the healing from those little monk enemies plus the blood magic of those scarabs makes them pretty tanky. In condition. Still gonna be picking up these kind of items so I can sell. I want to try and get at least... I can't remember how much money we need for max armor. Probably need at least 10k uh, platinum. 10k gold. I haven't been salvaging anything. Much. I'm not really sure what, uh, oh, hello. I'm not really sure what materials we need. Get them clumped up a little bit. Clump up a little. No, nope, they're spread out. Alright, here we go. Gotcha. Ah, they spread out. Darn. Try that again. Oh, you heal up. 
Yeah, so this is where having higher armor would be better. Let me turn down my volume a little. My game volume at? That was pretty loud there for a second. Turn it down a smidge. Yeah, clumsiness was really nice there, was it? I think it was anyway. I got a little bit scared, honestly. Panicked a little bit. Whoops, wrong button. Okay. Yeah, so we got rid of the immolation, which would trigger about 28 damage from fragility and replace it with clumsiness, which does AOE 59 damage. Pretty nice. All right, made it. So what we've discovered is that these little statues, sometimes, I'm not sure if something happens here, but sometimes when you kneel at these statues, something happens. Anything happen? Oh, okay. Uh, many are the aspects of Melandru. Do you dedicate this offering to one in particular? Let's do courage. Oh, we just get a morale boost. That's it. Good to know. Useful if you're uh, vanquishing this area, I guess. Fast casting chakram. Hey, we don't have eight fast casting, but look at that. 15 energy, 30 health. Just just for, for free, it gives it to you. I like our jeweled chalice. And we don't need that much energy. We already have the 15 energy from Arcane, so. And we don't even have Gale Fins, so. Whatever. Talk to Old Joan. I always thought his name was Old Jones. What is Jonas? What is it, old man? I hear you have a son. Did? Yes, Edgar was his name. Good, smart lad. A little too smart for his own good. At times, he ran afoul of bandit. Who you? And who gave you Sansa? Edo did. True, Edgar was one to speak his mind. I say he was smart, but sometimes his tongue got ahead of his brain. Okay. No friends of ours. I believe it to be true. We can leave any time. Oh, that's it. Well. That would make this a very short episode if I stopped here. So let's move on to the next part. Go ahead and do this mission. A human here. Let's reach out and see... They're here for real. Are you here? They're level 20. Usually level 20 people are not actually here. They're doing their own like Zyshin mission or something. Let's just grab our henchmen. I think for this we need all range henchmen actually. Because we need to be a little bit stealthy from what I remember. Mm, let's go for it. Make some... Make some, uh... Inventory. Clear some of our inventory out. Okay. Alright, let's try it out. Riverside Province. I think we have this mission and then one more mission and then we are done with the um, Raita and Maguma jungle. Steal the Scepter of Ore. Avoid detection on your way to the temple. Talk to Dinus to get the Scepter. Escape to the bridge. So this is a, this is our first like stealthy mission. 
we're going to be staring at our mini map up here, at our compass map, at our little aggro bubble. And we're going to be wall hugging. Sticking along these walls. And the reason why I want range, range uh, henchmen is because uh, melee henchmen just kind of charge in unwantedly. Aitra. I think this mission can be short or long, depending on doing the bonus and depending on um, getting lost or not. Be careful in these parts. The White Mantle see everything from the tops of their watch watchtowers. I don't remember her looking like this. Looks pretty cool though. What? Why am I attacking White Mantle right now? Oh. Get out of here. I thought... I thought this gate's supposed to open up. Hmm. I guess we do need to do some fighting. We might have just failed the mission already. Oof, that was close. I stopped talking because I needed to concentrate a little bit there. Freaking Alicia coming in clutch with the healings there. Whew. It was very scary. Now are you going to talk to me? I could have sworn he like opens this up. Hmm. That's not. What's the bonus here then? And that was really close. How are we level? Everything's level 18 and we're still 16 to 15. We're slightly under level for this mission. Undead. Get them grouped up a little bit. Very nice. Oh. oh, right, those Hellhounds, they use uh, Frenzy, so they take tons of damage. Take double damage. Best to burst them down quickly. We're going to hug the wall again. I think this is going to take a little strategy. Um, take, let's keep an eye on... Their movement patterns really quick. We might need to hug this bottom wall and go around. Okay, so they're all converging right here. Good be able to sneak around. Very quiet. Nice. Uh-oh. Don't come any closer. Got it. Just a few of them now. Stay close. Do not go near the tower. Oh no. We keep aggroing more and more. Get over here, dummies. Yeah. I think we I think we really messed up. Donham isn't even doing anything. Alright. Get over here. Over here. 
Take out the Abbot. That was lucky. Why did they just suddenly run away? Very strict. Now these guys should go into the middle here and then we can sneak around again. The wait. I was very close. I probably should have just gone with my gut and gone up that way. Like that. Um hmm. Any second now. <laughs> Why are they not moving? We go around? Try this route. Why are they not moving at all? Oh, I pro- yeah, here's a little secret route. I probably should have gone this way from the beginning. Come on. Move. This is not the way- this is definitely the way I go. They glitched? I mean, I can't fight all of them. One, two, three, four, five, six, level 18. Couple level six. Should I try and... I guess I should try and pull some of them away. I don't want to. Yeah, it might be two separate groups, right? Try it. What we have to do. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Never mind. Just want this small group over here. Okay. A little bit closer. Yes. No, come back. And keep dodging. Yes, yes. Okay. Ooh, nice meteor from uh, Orion there. Oh, I'm standing in fire. I'm on fire. No, come back. Okay. Man, I don't remember having to fight like this. Maybe I'm misremembering this. Mission. There we go. Nice interrupt. Very good. Alright, now we can fight him. It's just three. Good progress. That was a little bit slow, but we survived and we did it. Mm, the watchtower down that way, so let's head over this way. Looks like a good way to go. Very out of the way. Generally avoiding the watchtowers is a smart idea. 
I mean, now we're just avoiding everybody, so... No idea if this is correct or not. Probably a dead end. Oh. Level 20s? Holy cow. Burst him down. Probably not so bad. Good experience, too. And luckily, the AoE and massive damage we're doing just made them run around. Nice. Very good, very good. So that's why we were not fighting any enemies, because we encountered level 20s. Probably not the only group of level 20s we're going to face. This looks like a good spot. I was about to say, this looks like a good spot for an ambush. Arcane Thievery, man. Very good. That way. We just keep staying on this right path. I have no idea if this is a waste of time or not. I actually do not remember this at all. Ease that burst. Clumsiness, phantom pain, shattered illusions. It's just crazy damage. That was good. That was a nice detour. Might have been the long way around, but um, at some point we need to go get the staff, though, don't we? I think it's this way. Right? Where that glowing light is? That's probably where it's at. Uh, yeah, I think we need to keep going around, though. That's just gonna take us on a back track. We're kind of looping around here. We need to head that way or something. more more undead okay. Do not want to go down there that looks like bad news I'm gonna go up here not over aggro it looks like two groups right there Kind of merge together. Avoid them. Okay. Oh. Cool. We need to go. We need to go back that way. I think. I feel like we passed the staff. Okay, this is the end of the mission. I think. Alright, I cannot fight all of them. They're blocking my way. Damned clerics. Uh we do. Yeah, we need to go over here. Maybe I'm taking stealth a little too seriously. Maybe there's a back way we can go. Yeah, it looks like this leads to the back. Hill giants. I mean, generally the game kind of tells you if there's a, a huge group of enemies that just looks a little too intimidating, that's probably not the way to go. Dang. Knew I wasn't going to be able to make that. Clumsiness. 
Nice interrupt. Clutch, Orion. Ah, uh, buddy. Don't need a sparkler. Can we go this way? I don't think so, actually. We need, need to go backward. Well, in any case, we're kind of clearing the way. The exit. If you're following this, <laughs> uh, consult a guide first. Oops. Oh, Giant Stomp counts as an attack. I should definitely try and get Clumsiness off first to block that. This is not the way. Just clear them out anyway. Nice, yeah, see it blocks it. Oh, I was giving Orion credit for that when actually it was me. Wow, clumsiness, man. I'm so glad I picked that up. It's very, uh, it's very thematic to use against a stupid giant also. All right. This seems to be... End. Not? Dead end? Uh, this is not the way to go. We are back here, and these guys are still blocking our way. How many are there? Too many. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We're outnumbered. I'm pretty sure those... Uh, what do you call it? Those horsemen also raise minions. We're going to go back around. And... Okay, that te that seemed to be a really pointless route. I don't I'm not even sure I'm going to edit this video so far, but we ran all the way this back way avoiding everyone except a few enemies here and there and it took us way off path. We got stuck by these stupid undead guys here, so we backtracked even further. Let's check out this path. I think if I can figure out a way to just like times x speed or whatever and just kind of rush show you my my speed run through here really easy to get lost turns out here scared me a little bit oh my god no 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 oh shoot i did not mean to over aggro like that I think we're dead. In which case, yep, he over aggroed. And they were not supposed to be next to each other, man. Are we okay? Not so bad. 
here. Wow. I need to have more faith. Really thought we screwed that up. Alright, take this guy out, please. Wow, what a roller coaster so far. Can you guys like heal me? What are, what are you guys standing there doing? Like, come on. <laughs> that was crazy. My henchmen are just like, you know what? You got this. Just 1v1 this guy. Okay. Man, that was scary. All right, they're just groups of three here, so I think we're meant we're meant to fight this out, actually. Clumsiness. Are we blind? Perfect. They're running around like chickens. Get off another clumsiness. Dang, Executioner tr Strike just chunked, chunked my health. Okay. Woo! I really thought we were gone there. All right, we're, we're going up here. Here's Jonas. What is Jonas doing? Oh, they're fighting. Save Jonas. What the heck? They just... They just totally destroyed Jonas. Maybe he's not important. I feel like he was. Ooh, nice. Purple tunic. Hey, you're casting... Casting fragility on me? How dare you? See what was in that tunic. Radiant Divine Favor 2. Not great. Radiant's not bad, but. We might sell it for the gold. Man, I'm loving clumsiness, dude. Can't say it enough. up here to fight this guy, I guess. Maybe the game... Maybe the game... Um, when I put this flag for this mission, maybe it automatically made it to where they go on avoid combat. For the specific reason of not pulling not over aggroing very possible go this back way I really want to fight this guy if I don't have to good Oh man, we took a really long way to do this. Here's Dinus though. My friends, it is good to see you again. <laughs> I, I didn't think when we met off the Delessio seaboard that I would be giving you the scepter of ore. Come, you must not linger here. The zealots will be back. Why is he helping us then? I will show you the quickest escape route. Interesting door shorts or leotard, whatever you're wearing. To the east is a bridge that will take you over the Ulan River to safety. Stay off the beaten path. I guess they didn't pay do, any uh, voice actors to. Many men have died for this. Or the main character to say anything here. With your life. 
Uh oh. Been spotted. Yo. Who's he gonna tell? How does he know that? Come on. There are two watchtowers between here and the river. If they try to go past, they will be caught. If they stop to ponder a way around, we will catch them. Thanks for no that little tidbit. White mantle lives long enough to enjoy the spoils. Well, sounds like uh, the voice sounds very similar to like uh, orcs from Warcraft or something. <laughs> Scepter of Ore, what does it give us? Plus one energy regeneration. That's pretty good. Look at that. Five pips of energy regeneration. It could be more powerful than that, though. Come on. Stupid I Will Avenge You spell, man. This sucks. Deep wound spike is no joke, though. The scepter of war, like, way bigger than regular staffs. It looks massive. Guy's a dead eye. Level 21. Holy cow. Ooh, I stole the Chaos Storm. Very nice. Take that. Yeah, look at the, the energy with Blood Ritual. Look at my energy. It's crazy. Good, good, good. Yeah, that sparkler. Are the Okay. Lost my audio there for a second. Fixed it. I was about to say, are the white mantle really on me? Or is it just for I'm still here? Can we fight that? I guess we can go around. We did already clear this area. I don't want to risk fighting those guys. Back way. We already cleared this, so I don't mind going this back way anymore. We should be able to quickly run. Hurry up, spike him down. Take him out. Okay. We're gonna... That's the good news. We did already finish this, so we can we can make use of that route. You know what? Maybe we'll just say we did it on purpose. We got completely and hopelessly lost on purpose. Now this is clear of enemies. We can just run through here safely. But we do, instead of going that back way up here where all those mountain giants, or hill giants were, we, we are going to need to go this way, I think. Pretty sure that cutscene, they just try to scare you with like saying they're, they're on your tail, but 
I think you ha there's no timer or anything, you know? It's not like that first mission with the char where it gave you a timer. Yeah, it worked out well. We never got any bonus objectives. I'm pretty sure it was Jonas who we let get slaughtered in between the white mantle and the undead. That was a pretty brutal death that we witnessed. No bonus objective, but I'll be happy to get through this mission alive. We're creeping up on the enemies here. What? Oh, they got poisoned just from the water. That scared me. We're going to go this high road. I wish the undead were to kind of help me out here. Careful here. We're just going to sneak around. Go, 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 go. That's the road we're looking to take up there. Oh, he said there was two. There's one. There's two watch. There's a second one up straight ahead. I think we need to go this way. Yeah, follow the road. Almost home free. Oh, there's... Oh, okay, there's the second watchtower. What was that one then? That was like a ruins? Oh, that's one. I don't think the guard even knew how many watchtowers there were. Cyrus the Unflattering. I don't think we need to fight this guy, actually. I think we just need to run across. Oh my gosh. So many of them. Just take him out really quick. He's he's not attacking us. Is it because our henchmen are not attacking him? Why are they not attacking? Just why? Oh, that was weird. How is he not attacking us? Is it because he beat us there? I guess? I don't know. That was weird. Huh. Not our most elegant mission run, but we got across. Oh, jeez. against our oppressors has finally arrived i thought the point of stealing the scepter was to keep it from the mantle how are we going to use it we can't but the zirkil braun can i negotiated a treaty with the former advisor to the king of or in exchange for the scepter the good vizier has agreed to aid us in our fight against the mantle vizier kilbron what can one man do for us that we can't do for ourselves? A good question. The Vizier is a very powerful mage. He can show us the path that will lead to our victory. Come now. The sun will be rising soon, and we must prepare for our journey to meet the Vizier. All right. What news of Marcus? Marcus? Why would we have news of him? He didn't meet you outside the temple. No, we knew of no such plan. Hmm. Maybe he'll catch up with us at the docks. Let's go. Even the mantle are smart enough to find their way across that river. Marcus. We'd best not be here when they do. What kind of accent does she have? It sounds almost Jamaican. Ooh, that was not a pretty mission. But we're very happy to finish that. I'm going to have to do some funny editing to... Uh, not make it such a waste of time but anyway thank you all for watching again we are here at sanctum k which maybe we can um do a little collaboration with our good friend uh playing guild wars 
or Guild Wars in 2024. We'll shoot him a message. He said he had a ranger here, so anyway. This is a this is a pretty great mission coming up because this is like a opens up another chap a new totally new chapter of the storyline. So stay tuned for the next episode and thanks for watching this one. Uh that'll be the end of this one. All right, catch y'all later. Bye.